Hey guys, welcome back to another video here at Creators Theory. In today's video, we'll see how to create a zoom through eye effect in Filmora. But before starting this tutorial, if you don't have a latest version of Filmora, then you can download that from the link in the description below. And if you're new to this channel, then do hit the subscribe button and follow for more Filmora related tutorials. So let's get started with the tutorial guys. As you can see, I've already added uh, the media in the bin. So I will be using this, uh, let me just bring it to the timeline. So I will be using this video as the main video and I will zoom through into her eye. Uh, and from this, I will go into the second video. But before adding the second video into the timeline, I will just go to the last frame. So make sure which frame you want to be the last frame of this video of this first video so i will take the end of this video last frame of this video as the last frame and i will take a snapshot by going over here and clicking on this camera icon over here so once you have taken the snapshot it will automatically appear into them in the media bin so you might uh, need to note the location where this snapshot has been stored so go, click go, right click on it and go to properties and here you will see the location so once you are uh, final with that let's go into the second part of this video so welcome to the second part of this video here we will be doing the masking of the snapshot that we just took so you need to go to pixlr.com so this is a free online for photo editing masking uh, platform so just go into pixlr.com the link will be in the description below you can use that and go ahead and here go into advanced photo editor and you will be taken to this page here just click on open image once you click select the snapshot photo and click on open so as you can see the snapshot image has been opened so what i will do i will just zoom into her eyes first and uh, let me just position this so what i need to do i need to mask this much area so i will go into the scissor over here and as you can see if you hover over it it will show cut out and mask click on it and here go into draw mask and uh, as you can see this is size of the brush is big i will go into brushes and i will reduce the size I will increase the softness a little bit and let's check now as you can see the size is okay so what I will do I will just click so as you can see the mask is, is done so you can select as much mask uh, you want to do so I just want this much mask so once this is done I will click on file export and export quick export image as png so make sure you select quick export image as png and the snapshot will be downloaded so now let's go to the third part of the video where we'll be combining all of this together and creating the zoom through effect so welcome back so we are in the last part of this tutorial so as you can see i have uh, uh, imported the masked image so let me just bring this into the timeline so what I will do, I will place it above the video and uh, let's just decrease the size and let's just bring this video under it. So now if you hover as you can see in our eyes you can see the video behind it. So that's why we do the masking so that the process is smooth. So once this is done, I will go into effects and in effects i will go into utility in utility you will select uh, tilt shift circle and drag this above the snapshot image that you just added decrease the size and if you see this gives a blur and uh, uh, effect into the snapshot so what this will help this will help in creating the zoom effect so i will just double click it I will increase the size a little bit and I will place this over here so that the face is in focus intensity I will decrease a little bit and click OK so as you can see uh, 
the blur effect has been added to the image now what i will do i will just click on the snapshot image and click on crop and zoom and here i will go to pan and zoom i will select the end part of this pan and zoom and i will make it as small as possible and i will drag this over to the eye so that the effect takes place it starts over here and zooms into the eye then click on ok let's just see how it plays out so as you can see let's just but as you can see uh, the image the video behind is a little visible so what i want to do i want to blend it with this image this video so what i will do i will go into the last frame of this snapshot cut this video over here and i will go to the color section and in the tone i will decrease the brightness a little bit the saturation and contrast and saturation both so i will try to bl blend this uh, eye flash uh, what do you say eyeballs a little bit and decrease the temperature maybe and click on okay so now let's see the effect So as you can see, if you think the effect is a little slow, what you can do, you can just uh, decrease the size of this uh, uh, snapshot and you can go ahead with the effect. As you can see the zoom through eye effect. so that's it guys with this zoom through eye effect i hope you guys like this video if you guys like it then do give it a thumbs up and if you want more such tutorial related to filmora then do subscribe to our channel and follow for more so that's it guys with this tutorial see you guys in another video till then see ya